Michael, what did you think of the presentation so far? It's been really, really interesting. I mean, each of them has been a different slant on uh, integrating green concepts and uh, practices into the data center, from storage to design. It's been great so far. We're planning on moving our data center. We learned a lot about some best practices, what, you know, some of the trials and tribulations that they went through, we're hoping not to go through it. I think I could better from that. I'm actually sending a, a text to the CIO when you ask that, you know, we learned we're using a microturbine technology. We, we asked the Green Grid members to, today about some of the microturbine technology, and, you know, they seem very excited in this way it's going for data centers in the future, where it's a dedicated source of power, and the absorption chiller is takes advantage of the efficiencies of a microturbine. Are you going to bring something back immediately to your uh, to your boss? What, what some of your thoughts? Uh, definitely, yeah. I am just about to, if I can uh, take them away from some of the other attendees here, talk to them about what I've learned uh, at the data center, especially the supercomputer center. I myself am new to the data center uh, environment and world, so uh, it was a really great opportunity for me to uh, to really see what a high tech, um, in influential. Uh, center can be. I mean, they're kind of a leader uh, that a lot of other environments and customers can take uh, notes from. So. Okay, uh, my name is uh, Vibbo Avis. I'm from the Netherlands and Europe. I traveled quite a long way to get here, but, you know, I, I didn't want to miss out on this one. Uh, what I learned today, actually, is uh, uh, a lot of new stuff. Um, I spent the meeting, or, or the presentation uh, this morning, uh, the Green Grid and Chris Page of Yahoo, who kind of gave me a couple of eye-openers there. 